Hey guys, today we're going to be working on how to change your boot logo on iOS 7 for the iPhone 5S. Since many of you are actually having a lot of trouble trying to change your boot logo, and I've noticed on tutorials that there's not many out there, just for the iPhone 5 actually. So let's get started. Right, so what we want to do is go into Cydia. Let's give that a moment. You might want to let that load. So we go to search and we're going to install something called animate. Now, as you can see here, I already have it installed for the sake of time. So you guys go ahead and work that out. So when you're done, we go back to search, animate, and then we just type in fix four. And there we go, iOS seven, install that as well. So once you're done with that, I highly recommend installing iFile. Now, some of you might be prompted to pay up. However, if you guys know your way around, you're not going to have to pay. Uh -huh. So, now we go back and we open. Actually, we stay in Cydia and we go to the sections and we look for add-ons, boot logo. So let's just download one. Let's do this one. Install it. Confirm. So we go back. Now we gotta go home and go into our iFile application. Now I've noticed that you guys are clicking here where it says library, where it says var mobile library. No, you're not gonna get any boot animation folder in there. Actually, what we have to do is go all the way back, and there should be a file here also named library. There you see boot logos, and there we go. We have copy of blue screen of death, something we just downloaded right now. So click on the info pane thing and delete copy of. Since we don't really need that, and it's just, I don't know, it just doesn't look right. All right, so we're done with that. Now, what it asks us to do next is add a folder named org dot chronic uh oh sorry chronic dev dot animate now very important guys remember to change your attributes type file into regular file regular file all right, now we just create that and we go back to the info pane on blue screen of death. We select the whole name, we copy it, done. Now we go into chronic dev animate again. Uh, sorry about that. So we select the whole thing. Now some of you might be prompted with this or some of you might be prompted with another application. If the other application keeps popping up, I will have to ask you to uninstall that and stick with this. Now, when you guys get this, select Text Viewer, Edit, and Paste the Blue Screen of Death folder name. Now we're going to click Save, Done. However, there's one last step that many of you are actually missing is to go into the Info Pane and write down dot .plist. Now once you're done with that, all you got to do is go back to library and reboot your iDevice and you're actually going to see that you actually get the animation. Make sure to look at the description below this video for the instructions on how to set an animated boot logo for the iPhone 5S devices. Thanks to Ryko who provided us the information and iTweaks for showing us an example and a tutorial on how to install it on the iPhone 5. Now, if you guys have any questions or any comments, make sure to write them down below and I'll get back to you as fast as I can and when I'm not busy and I'll try to help you guys out. If you guys have any other suggestions, uh, make sure to let me know. Thanks.